here we are on a Monday. Yeah, yes, that is that is the look we'll give you if you are not clicking on the like. Welcome, welcome to Coffee with FDR. I am Wes from here at Rich New Design. Joining me is Allie, L L G L E G, uh, uh, professional degenerate goblin artist Allie Patches uh, over here. Yeah, and down below it is Will Dick from the Art of Floundering podcast. You're you're muted, Mr. Will Dick. Uh, welcome into the show. Welcome into the show. I know we're running over there on the Art of Floundering. How you doing today? How you doing today, everybody? Wonderful, man. It's Monday. It's a new week, man. It's a new it's week. A, it's a new week. It's a new month. It's April, April Fool's Day. Fool's Day. I, I saw a short Gampro had posted. Does April Fool's actually mean anything anymore? Because everything is just so asinine. We get confronted with crap on a daily basis that we're all like, no, that's crazy. Does does April Fool's, does anybody even do anything for that anymore? Is it even a thing? Let me see. See if we got He's any April check. Fool's jokes in the news. He's going to check. There may be some in the news. Everybody out there, I hope everybody's having a great day. Make sure you click on that like, all the other, all the other happy stuff. Maybe we ought to get some links posted and pinned in the chat. You know, pretend like, uh, pretend like we know what we're doing here uh, at... Coffee with FDR. Oh my God. Oh my God. It's it's such a it's such a day. Look at these look at these designs. We're just gonna bounce around and oh, Tana is out there. Pinzer is hey, out Tana. there. Hey, Pinzer. Oh. Pinzer. Yes, yes. We are the fools. Tana, peace and love. Tana, peace and love. We're we're doing our coffee with uh, FDR because we're contractually obligated by the sponsors. To have to be here Monday through Friday at 4 p.m. For what? I'm not sure. We show up. We do this. That's our thing. Buddha. Buddha. Peace and love. Peace and love. Buddha. Good to see you. Now, uh, uh, we, we can't really move forward without talking about the breakout success over here. The, uh, the live streams, these long-ass live streams, painting live streams <coughs> that are going on at night. That are getting that are getting a lot of views and a lot of attention uh, over there on Alley Patches. Uh, oh, what's what's up with that, Alley? What's up with that? Uh, you're making the rest of us look bad. You, uh, you know well, that, that's right? That's my goal is to make you guys look bad. That's right. That's right. Yep. Is that shit? Nobody told me there were goals with any of this. Nobody said oh, yeah. anything. You guys, you guys don't set goals for yourself. No. You gotta drink no. Eight, eight. You know glasses of water a day okay okay well i'm gonna make that's the first one i'll address next <laughs> so then um you know the next is you gotta make at least 10 people laugh during the day i like i like that i like that do i have to talk to the 10 people is that do yeah. i have to see them do i have to oh fuck that yeah and that then um, you know make the rest of your castmates look bad because i'm fun <laughs> All cool. right, well, what? And, and and that is why we don't do better here at FDR. Frank did Rhonda. Yeah, she's going to get her coffee. I'm going to talk bad about her right now. She's doing these paintings at night, and there's such a chill vibe and everything, and everybody just ends up showing up over there. It is. Uh, she ends up with these phenomenal lives that she does, and they just go on and on. Brandy, Brandy, peace and love, Brandy. And I see John out there. John P. Adventures. Oh, and look, there's Calix. Oh. Oh. Hey, yeah, Calix. we weren't we don't look to you to solve things, Calix. We we see you drinking. We don't look to to any type of insight <laughs> or anything along those lines. Don't worry, the bar's low. The bar's low, Calix. It's just, <laughs> Bell Admin. Good to see you. Peace and love. Everybody make sure you're clicking on that like. And Buddha's bringing Buddha's bringing all of them through. Buddha's giving that support. They're just you're awesome, Buddha. You're awesome. And speaking of awesome, if you're in the rich new design chat, let me put the banner up because this at least gives function and purpose to this. You know, uh, uh, hashtag awesome. If you're in my chat, if you want to get connected to other people that you don't know and you want to drop your link or something along those lines. Now. Uh, 
I know I had a rough weekend. That's why I did not, I did a minimal amount of stuff uh, because because of my personal situation and other things along those lines. But I, I, I fear, did we, did we see the, the actual gospel? Did the, did the gospel? No, I up? didn't, I didn't do any of that, man. Like oh. I said, after Saturday, um, I mean, everybody was doing Easter shit yesterday. It just, you know, and so I'll do it later. I'm not, I, I got an open mic tonight, so I'm going to break out slider. I'm, I'm, I'm making a. Astro Glide. I went and bought some new Astro Glide. A, a quick tip: I, I should. I had to empty out all the goo from the the, the tube of Astro Glide so it can lay flat. I, they didn't have any decent glue, Ali. You know, it was bullshit glitter glue and all this stuff. So it was Walmart. Not. I don't shop at. Um, what's the other? What's the fucking big one? Hobby. I don't the shop Hobby there. Lobby. No, no, I go to Michael's, but I, I avoid Hobby Lobby. It's a personal thing with what they do. But mm -hmm. I, uh, you know, I needed super glue. And it'll work tonight because my plan is I'm going to bring out Bernard. There's no heroes in the world, but yes, there are. There's super duper peachy keen kid, but then super duper peachy keen kid blows it on the date. Weed pusher man shows up, gets him on weed. It's all over America, but then Slider comes in. <laughs> and saves the day so i'm sure that, the potheads will be able to deal with it the yeah. potheads will be able to deal with it that's going to be awesome if uh if you bring the slider bring an actual an actual slider. i'm gonna i'm gonna try to a hey, pinzer i'm gonna try to oh pinzer walking the covenant path man way to go um it'd be <laughs> one of these days pinzer we ought to talk some mormonism but the uh Mormon. Talk. Yeah, we'll see what it was. I'm trying to. There, there's some. There's this outfit in Denver that is, you know. Yeah, I, I don't. I've never dealt with these fucking assholes before, and they all seem like assholes. But you know, they're like, come up to Denver, and because we want to see it, we heard about the show, we'd like to see it. And I, I said, how about if I film it? I don't want to drive all the way to fucking Denver to go to an open mic, you know? Right. And because it's like hit and miss. I'm not. You know, some of these things, like I went to one Thursday, there was, I, I didn't even bother. There was nobody in the place. It's like, uh, you, you know, but we'll see. Anyway, yeah, if they, don't, about my if they don't bother to have any, any crowd, well, no, you're the one going out doing stuff. We're, we're, everything we end up doing, we're doing, we're doing here. We're doing uh, out here on the internet and all that. You're at least, uh, you're at least out there. Well, oh, I hope sort it's of. I hope it's not me. Okay, everybody else. I'm hoping that yeah. wasn't my camera that kind of froze up. Uh, you're you're going out there and you're doing things live at these open mics and everything along those lines. So you know that that's kind of a little more interesting than you know what what I, I know what I got going on. I'm I'm just picking up a bass and doing stupid noises online. That's all I have. Well, play. I mean, I, I, I mean, I took like it's weird because it's like it's co fucking cold again, and the, the problem is I'm old as fuck, and I've got all these cages in my spine. So, I mean, you can't tell, but when it's cold, it just, like, sucks. And it's fucking cold again tonight, so we'll see what happens. Ugh. That, that, uh, see, it's 70s here. It's gotten warm. It's, it's now humid. I'm feeling a little bit of a, I've had all this coffee, and now I, I feel the sweat. I feel like I'm sweating from the coffee. And from the days of edibles. I mean, the whole weekend was just edibles. And Mississippi, the state of Mississippi's got the lowest yes. cost of living in the United States and and liberal weed laws. Now, I lived in Mississippi a million years ago. My dad was in Vietnam. And when he was in Vietnam, I was in Atlantic City. After Vietnam, the Army had this uh, program called Bootstrap where... The people that were officers that didn't have degrees, they and this is what, you know, my dad was made an officer after they drafted him. Right. So they sent him to U University of Southern Mississippi in Hattiesburg. This was 1974. Now, I was in fourth grade. Get ready for this. So when you hear people talk about, oh, you know, all this <laughs> racism's yesterday's news, I was in a segregated baseball league in, in me alive in 1974. There was this kid in fourth grade 
and he was really good in baseball. And I'm like, dude, what team do you play for? And he told me the team. I said, I don't recognize the team. He goes, oh, it's a separate league, man, for, for, for black players. This was it, Look it up. It's called – my dad went ballistic. It's called Dixie Youth Baseball. I had no idea. My family, we had no idea. You know, oh, let's go put them in Little League. And it was like, what the fuck? It was sex- y- 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 it was crazy. Mississippi 74. was a little bit slower than the rest of the country. It's, Mississippi it's not yet, is. Well, I mean, but but like we talked about, I find the worst places in the country for racism is the Northeast. Jersey, um, fucking Philly. Yeah. Ugh. Bad. Anyway. It's... It 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 does kind of it does kind of and that uh, seventy four in those areas that would be a it would be a year or two after that that uh, the city I was in in Illinois uh, oh, went God. through the busing uh, and all of yeah. a sudden all of a sudden the schools were completely different and everything along those lines uh, it was a, it was an experience uh, well didn't quite they an have experience. Didn't, good experience but. Skokie, Illinois, isn't that the home of like? Uh, I don't want to say it because it'll fucking mess up the stream. I'll say but, it. I mean, uh, 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 yeah, the the, the, the Illinois, American Nazi, the Illinois the, yeah. Nazis, yeah, they won the Illinois Nazis. Nazi. Yeah, that was that was the Blues Brothers covered that because they won their yeah. they won their case. They were gonna do that, and uh, that was a huge uh, case. That was right around the time of Gary Gilman. We're old as fuck. I mean, because that was right around the time of uh, Gary Gilmore. If anybody doesn't remember that famous case, Gary Gilmore was in um, Utah. He was a career criminal. Uh, not he, he was taught to be a criminal. You know, rest. You know, arrested as a juvenile, and then over time just became a. So he was out, and um, he killed two people, and they gave him the death penalty, and he didn't appeal it. He's like, fine, you, you, you need to kill me. And they're like, wait a minute. Well, you got to like, appeal. It was a, yeah, yeah. It was a good book uh, in a movie uh, with Tommy Lee Jones called Executioner's Song about Gary Gilmore. It's on YouTube. It's a fascinating case. So that, that's how old I am. <laughs> old as fuck. There you go, everybody. I like it. I like it when on a Monday we go right there to the, oh, oh we're old as fuck. That's, that's what a Monday vibe is. Big Mo, peace and love. Gemma out there, peace and love. I see Brandy still hanging. I see Calix is still hanging. Tan is still hanging. Have I missed anybody else? Oh, Calculator. Mr. Calculator, hey, man. Calculator man. Tosh and Rexler. Uh, uh, hey, welcome in. Welcome in. Pins is uh, hanging out. Trending live, trending in Buddha. Love all the support. And I saw the Jay Jordan. You you did a, a he did a I got time yesterday, and uh, and I had I was considering it, but my mood was still such a shit mood, and it was his birthday. It was his birthday. Ah, oh, dude, thought, happy birthday! I had thought about getting up and everything, oh, but uh, Ms. Say? Lee, well, it, I told everybody I I sang a song about it. The uh, <laughs> Sunday is Jay Jordan's birthday. I did a whole song the other night about it. What do you mean? Why well, didn't you didn't you? tell me specifically, so fail. I'll make fail. Okay, I saw I'll make sure him, the emails from now on. I, I saw him <laughs> doing a, a freestyle on your morning show, and it just reminded me how much I loved his okay. fucking free. Sh- I miss his fucking freestyles. Those are great. Oh, man. Mm-hmm. And and especially his dirty ones on the... Uh, that, that's, we exactly, would, exactly. The Friday yeah. shows, the Friday shows were just, he can go there. And the thing is, he does it all clean. He doesn't drink. He doesn't do. The only thing running through his system is probably a uh, cereal. Burpees. He, uh, well, burpees. He's he got all the adrenaline. Burpees. He's doing fucking thousands of burpees. But no, he eats cereal and and <coughs> other things like that. But he uh, he was doing the freestyle. That was a good time having him up. Emp got up and uh, and played some music. It was because I was delirious. I hadn't slept. I couldn't sleep. I like I say, I'm dealing with this. Oh, oh, and I can feel the tension in my neck as I'm even thinking about it. Dealing with this uh, situations with uh, uh, children and uh, and uh, you know and oh god, I I, I don't I don't even spiritual you know what's awakening. Interesting. Bob's yes, I cigars. I'm just yesterday. I, I it's I don't know if you guys deal with this, but you know, um, a lot of people who. Uh, 
when you're older, you recognize this. I, there's a lot of people I know from my past experience that were very highly religious. I was never this way. But as they get older, for whatever reason, they, they, they start looking into what it is their belief system is. Usually around the age of 35, as I've noticed, this has happened. Their kids are getting older. Life is slowing down. So they've been in this thing their entire life. And now for the, you know, the pandemic hits and they start looking into it. And then after, you know, 30, 40 years of their life, it's like, uh, I now don't believe in this thing that I used to like believe in. And it's like, it's like traumatic when these, these, these religious holidays come up because it's like their family's not talking to them. It's just yep. guys, politics and religion. Come on, man. I mean, we all have different opinions, but to disown people because of the way you fucking interpret what we all don't fucking have a clue about. Like, it's just like, you know, you say, oh, Wes, I can't I can't hang out with you because you don't believe in the same myth that I believe in. It's just fucking nuts, dude. But this is what you see. And what I tell people, because they're, they're like, oh, God, I don't know what to do. I feel like I wasted 40 years of my life. I tell, you know, it's that bullshit. Hey, man, that 40 years got you to this point. So now you've learned all these lessons for the second phase, you know. But it's it's it, I don't. Do you have a lot of uh, religious friends in your network? I I know we're not religious, but I do have some that are that used to be at least. You know, I have I have a, a number of family members that claim to be religious. You know, you talk about the the examining and all that. My brother, my brother for for a time was until he got to about the age you're talking about, the mid thirties started to question and went to the church to ask the questions and was told he doesn't have enough faith and blamed his lack of faith. They then made the mistake of blaming his uh, son's autism on his lack of faith. And uh, that, that kind of accelerated his, okay, wait a minute, this doesn't seem holy or good or anything. He, he has, he goes into other, you know, uh, some people... Some people gravitate to something else. They've got to cling to something else. Uh, right. Some people will kind of, okay, I have to be all right with not knowing and not <clears throat> having something I need to believe in. Uh, he was one that he's gone to the the reincarnation side. So he started talking about uh, more Eastern and, oh, you reincarnated. And I said, oh, my God, doesn't that frighten you? I said, you, you're born into this time in uh, history a, a, a male here in uh, the U.S. of A. Uh, the you're you're not even really in the in any type of lower economic. You're you're doing okay and everything along those lines. I said, think about the amount of people that have it worse off than you. What are the odds if you're being reincarnated that it's going to be better than this? Uh, what are the odds that it's not going to somehow be some other shitty existence that your next one? Uh, if you have a good existence, the thought of reincarnation has got to be kind of, hmm, I don't know. I don't know. I, I'm going to come back as as something that's getting eaten alive or something along the It frightens me. Hey, Allie. Hey. I just Stones. saw you had unmuted. I just said I, I didn't know. Uh, have you been keeping up with chat, Allie? Do you know what's going on in chat? I'm I, talking I to do. good news. Uh, Gemma wrote a poem today about missing chemicals because she she is autistic and um, she writes about her experience. She also does a lot of uh, informative videos on her channel. I think everyone should check it out. Gemma, Gemma, peace and love Gemma. I know Gemma's got a wrench out there so Gemma can drop some links and everything for all that stuff. And is there not, is it not, uh, yes, Missing chemicals. There's the uh, thank you for highlighting that because you know my my attention does not work. I'm I'm on. I'm doing. I'm doing things that are a little bit iffy. C W <laughs> Chantel. Hello. Peace and love. <laughs> You're laughing about the iffy line. Is that was that funny? Was that? Well, I'm not not using good judgment. I'm just. I'm not using good judgment. Life is just. Oh my God! It's out of control. What 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 am I doing now? But I'm I'm hanging in there. Buddha, peace and love, peace and love, everybody. Have you all clicked on that like? 
can we we have not we screwed up we did not drop the link to your catalog no we haven't oh. done any of that yet no look at it just slough it off like nothing i'm gonna i know I'm gonna do i it mean now. get with the program gosh I, darn it. it i really thought we would be doing that early but jeepers no. I'm, we're I'm not that we're, well no not the worst but you know oh. You know, you know when it it's did dropped. you? Is it dropped in both? So I'm I can dropping. pin it. Okay, I'm gonna. There we go. Oh, and the pin the message. All right, pin to the top. Pin to the top. Artwork products. Uh, go there. Look. Sign <laughs> up for. Uh, uh, do go ahead and sign up for the emailing list. When you go out there, it will pop up a uh, a window to ask if you want to. And the reason to do that is. She has everything listed and the prices set by Threadless. That way, whenever they have a sale, whenever they run some promotion, she gets included in those sales and everything like that. And if you sign up for the, uh, for the uh, mailing list, you'll get emails of the promotions and things along those lines. Maybe, maybe. Oh, uh, 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 Barbarella, I do not have black strings on the Dean. Uh, and it is green, so that's why I use it. And I wanted to mention, Bimbo's got the exact same bass I have. Uh, oh, only, that's uh, only Bimbo's awesome. is got the uh, the black strings on it. I also have the matching six string. I've also got the matching <laughs> uh, electric uh, for the purpose of having the green. It was actually bef not for green screening. It was for weed. Because I was doing all those weed songs, and I wanted green instruments to play uh, with Did the. You know? uh, <clears throat> and, and me or somebody else uh, yeah. is is that? Thank you, thank you. I just wanted to make sure I wasn't rabbit. I see rabbit out there. Hey, it's a rabbit. Also, Buddha. Which one are you talking about? Because I can I can upload it whenever. Buddha said I've been looking and didn't see uh, the painting from the other day. Where do I look? Oh, uh, it would have been uh, Night Before Last. Uh, Night Before Last is the one that uh, made uh, Buddha feel that it was, uh, it was uh, what was it, uh, uh, Rumi? Was that the, what was the name of the artist that it reminded oh, Buddha Rumi. of? Oh, yeah, Rumi, yeah, yeah, yeah. That was, uh, it was the piece before last. It would have been not last night's, but the night before. I pay That's attention. Before? I'm a degenerate, but I pay attention, and I remember attention. these details. I thought it was blue. Pays attention. Look. Calyx. Calyx. Oh, peace and love. Peace and love. Da, da, da. I'm going to dance. Mm. Mm. Here we go. Mm. Mm. Here we go. Mm. Mm. Here we go. Mm. <coughs> that That is going to help keep things going here at FDR because we are going to be coming back with comedy. We've got our... Uh, we got a lot of things in the works. We were supposed to work today, but some of us don't uh, don't get up there in the day, and others complain that others Is don't get up there in the day. Out? I don't know. I yes, yes. Okay, it was up. It was out, it was out when I went to bed. The sun was out when I went to bed, so I'm I'm well, not certain like of anything. Uh, everybody, make sure you click in the like. Click it. <clears throat> I just I'm so tired. I'm so tired. Uh, one of these days, I'll be dead one of these days. <laughs> I have perpetual you know, bruises under my eyes from be being sleep deprived. So, Well, you need to sleep more. You need to sleep more. Hank, Hank. I can't do a Dale Gribble. Let's see. <laughs> Hank. Shisha. Pocket sand. Nope. I can't. I can't do it. I can't do a Dale Gribble. I can't do a Dale yeah, Gribble. You have to answer for yourself. What do I? Oh, G Maze. I have to answer. <clears throat> uh, yes, I did see that you guys were on the panel. Uh, you know, some of us, some of us, and and uh, I think this is probably true for a lot, a lot of people that do different outside the box kind of things. Uh, uh, there, there's personal areas of my life that aren't going that well. You know, relationships fall apart. Sometimes, oh, Gorilla Gamer, peace and love, bam, 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 out there. Uh, uh, sometimes things, uh, and they weigh on you. And Saturday evening was one of those. Uh, I had I had kind of a, 
I'm going to say traumatic. I'm going to use the, the phrase traumatic because I believe I felt trauma. I believe I felt a little, uh, and I was ragey, but I just couldn't. I was not going to be of any use to anybody on that panel. I wasn't going to bring sparkles and sunshine to the show. I wasn't going to have any good to, to give anybody. And I don't want to, last thing I want to do is be a downer. The last fucking thing. I, I just want to make people laugh. I Yeah. I do not. That's why I didn't go live last night when I had more trauma. It was uh, one of those <laughs> more trauma. It was. It was. And I and I, I thought about going live. I saw Andy was uh, still awake. And I thought, well, Andy will get up and rant with me. I'll just, you know, do that or something. But no, I held it together. I held it together. That was that was what I was doing. Uh, uh, oh, is it Machete? I got to bring that up. Machete... 13 buddha support oh i love buddha you are so kind with all the with all the support coming out here this is awesome man calyx appreciate all of uh, everybody i want to make sure because uh i had mentioned it earlier we didn't end up seeing the the true gospel we didn't end up seeing the easter show there wasn't uh and the art of floundering podcast has an amazing an amazing come unto me easter with satan uh and and i'm I know he's got an open mic he's going to tonight, but yeah. there is the possibility because I've seen him come back from open mics. Oh yeah, really, really hitting it really hard on the uh, on the THC, and then just do some amazing. Uh, there was one that was a really long program that was a radio one. You just went radio on that one, and oh, yeah, you yeah. were with the guitar. I sat and listened to that, just loving every minute of that program. Uh, Thanks. Yeah, but make like sure. Oh, is this owie. it? Yes, let's pop that up. Let's see if this is the one Buddha's asking about. So cool. Is this the one, Buddha? Is this the one? It almost looks like a bison. Oh, I gotta, I gotta highlight this. Brandy remembers Satan saying her name. Uh, was that the one, Buddha? Yes, yes. I think I think that is the one. Yes, that's uh, cause Frozen Heart. That's uh, there's a number of them that uh, still need to go up. Uh, uh, what happens is she takes high resolution photos of the paintings, and then uh, those end up getting cleaned up and everything in Photoshop around the uh, edges and stuff like that, and then uh, made sure to be scaled so they they work and everything on. Uh, on threadless uh, on the shirts but no that was a fantastic one uh i'm looking out there to make sure i'm keeping up buddha Allie. yes yes she does great work doesn't she uh click uh the link at the top if you make sure if you haven't been out to her catalog get out there there's going to be more clearly this piece of art's going to go up since buddha's asking about it uh and those are available on everything prints mugs Shower curtains, uh, uh, welcome mats, probably just everything under the sun. Buddha is not Ali, but Ali could be Buddha. But I'm um, Should we? It, it does it need? Yeah, there you go. Now FDR. Let's talk a little bit about that. Coming back at the end of this month. It's April Fool's Day, everybody. And uh, we are your April Fools. And at the end of this month, we are coming back with FDR. It's our it's our improv comedy. Yes, the, there is one of the logos, the FDR logo. There are multiple logos, multiple. Oh, my God, look at that. Look at that. It's another awesome painting by Alan. Oh, my God, they get better and better, every one. It, look at the detail. Look at shit. Oh, geez, I almost came at that one. That was uh that was just shocking. That was shocking the way Oh, when they come up on you like that and you just Oh, it's too much. It's too much sometimes. <laughs> it's it's too much. <laughs> that was cool. There we go. There we go. You're muted. You're muted, Allie. That's fuck. That's right. The last one was made by Gampro. The last one was made by Gampro. There's uh, 
those are some of the some of the logos for our improv comedy program that we do with puppets and cartoons. For those of you that are fans, Saturday night, Saturday night is Funk Fest at Camp Gmay, and oh, shit. Uh, f- uh, yes, it's less than a fucking week away now. Oh uh, boy. I worked on my set uh, overnight. I did a little bit of work on it overnight. I'm feeling pretty good about it. I, I kind of have I have some ideas. Get higher, baby. Mm, get higher, baby. Don't ever come down. Free base. That is uh I think we're going to I think we're going to hear from Karen uh, from our lapstick program coming back in FDR. The Car- Karen cartoon is going to do a little bit of the funky singing over during my set uh but it's 25 acts funk fest that's on camp g may everybody should be there it's 4 20 p.m uh pacific time 7 20 uh on the on the east coast but it's 25 acts it's going to be a long program uh everybody's like 20 25 minute set uh show up have a good time it's going to be a blast uh i was it was cool seeing uh bimbo up there on the panel it was yes, cool it seeing, was. Uh, it very much so. Because uh, uh, that and Shelly, Shelly had made it up on the panel I know. too. Uh, yeah, Shelly is pot. out all the time. She was. Uh, <laughs> she was. She was on it. She was on drugs. Yeah. She Bad. she came up. She came up on that morning show. It's a cry for to help. test to test her microphone. It's a cry yeah. for help. No, <laughs> Shelly does. Shelly's not looking for help. Shelly's looking to keep maintain that buzz. That's what. <laughs> <laughs> the Adventurers Lounge, peace and love out there, peace and love. Everybody, make sure that you have clicked on that, uh, clicked on that like. Make sure that you are connected to all the channels. Make sure you're connected to LGLG. Make sure you are connected to the Art of Floundering podcast. Uh, it's also dropping the links to Gampro uh, at Gampro420, uh, and also make sure you're connected to Camp GMA. It's dropping the link for Charlie Wood. I'm not sure if it's dropping the one for Camp Gmay, but I believe the link... Oh, why did I... Yes. I'm not sure why I clicked on it, but I did. The link that Allie dropped and that I dropped in our chat to that YouTube is to Funkfest uh, that is going on this uh, this Saturday. I have a set that's going to be uh, 20, 25 minutes. I know Will Dick has a set that's going to be 20, 25 minutes. Those two are going to be back-to-back they're going to be the most eclectic of any of the sets uh, that you're going to see. So if you're looking for something to go good with your buzz on Saturday, uh, our time slot's going to be the one to, which I think is going to be somewhere around uh, 11 Eastern time, 1130, yeah, somewhere, not, yeah. somewhere late. It's, uh, I'm, I'm thinking he was saying something like uh, 8 or something like that for us, 820 or something. Well, that's Lost easy. love. Yeah, that's his time. It's like nine o'clock my time, and I think eleven your time is when we around the area we get started. I don't know. I'll be high. I'll figure it out the day. Of. It's 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 going to be a good time. It's yeah. going to be a good time. Uh, uh, I'm going to bring out the cartoon. I've got a couple of songs I'm going to do. I've been playing. So you know, I'm trying to do things with some sort of funk. Uh, and since I'm going to do the original, I do that vibe thing all the time uh, early on. That'll just be, and I may have, I may have Karen do the vibe, I may have Karen do uh, Super Freak, and then I'm, uh, and then I may have her leave, and I may come out. Although I may just have her do the whole set, because I, I, it depends on how the flow is. If everybody's, if if Gary's running chat and popping people's names up in the chat for me, uh, so they're coming up on the screen, that's going to give me a lot to work with as I'm playing and I'm working with her, so I can address the people out there and everything uh because i always leave room for the spoken word bs uh with the people out there da, 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 da. oh cool uh, uh, that hey a hey camp uh there's a uh every not this week but after funk fest uh normally it's an open mic a five hour open mic uh, if you've got decent sound and everything uh it'd be fantastic come over there and and uh Camp G May at Camp G M A Y Camp G May. Something funny's going on over here. Some someone's laughing. That is good. It's a good visual. Keep laughing. Ha ha ha! Everybody out there. Oh my God, I'm so worn out. 
But uh, so you're going to now? Is this an open mic you've been to before? Yeah, it's just, it's the I'm going to Vultures tonight. So, um, and then we'll we'll talk more afterwards. I'm going to talk to the guy about a couple things if he's there. He's been wanting to talk to me. I didn't go last week, but we'll see what happens. Well, last week was a, the real real shitty weather, right? Uh, yeah, I kind of crashed yeah, in. I was like, fuck that. It was snow and all this bullshit. But it's just, I mean, it's not, for most people, it's not bad. It's 45 degrees. For me, it's just like fucking miserable. Oh, I, I can handle 45. I mean, yeah, 45, I, I it's, mean, it's uh, we've got in the 70s now. Now, tomorrow, I think tomorrow is when the tornadoes all come ripping through here. So uh, everybody's all worried and hunkered down about all the springtime storms that are coming and all that. But, uh. You know, I I don't value I don't value life that much, so I'm not that worried about it. I'm doing okay. You know, well, if the wind comes, the wind comes. You're in the background doing some things. Yeah, I can make some jokes there. Yeah, I can make some jokes there. They had me running. Oh, see, more jokes. Just more jokes. Jess Martinez, come out to the West Coast. You know, that's 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 what we've talked about. Uh, Gary out there at Camp Gmay, he's uh, out there Actually in the West Coast. Actually thinking about it. Just I'm gonna. Get, I told him I'm gonna set up a tent. If if he's got property, I just I'll bring my tent. I'll set up a tent and just I'm gonna hang here, Gary. Let me live out here. That's your intent. Ah, 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 everybody, everybody, oh, let's give it up. Let's give it up for Allie, Allie Patches. If you look at the link at the top of the chat, you'll notice it's uh, it's her uh, link to her catalog where uh, all her artwork can be found. No, your comedy's good. Your comedy's good. You, I mean, comedy's you're, fantastic. Your art's amazing. Your art's yeah. fucking amazing. Your your comedy's fantastic. You're muted. I mean, that uh, it looks unprofessional with the way you're muted and nodding, but you know that's fine. That's fine. We don't we don't expect a lot. Your comedy is good. It's very good. Yes, just nod. <laughs> that's that's the funny joke. Round of applause. Round of applause. There you go. Yay. Yay! No, everything is uh, everything is going well, and we're having the uh, uh, the art of floundering. Will Dick from the art of floundering is going to he goes and does uh, uh, actual actual open mic nights, uh, and he brings the puppets. He he shows up at these open mic nights, and uh, and you can only imagine. I uh, that that has got to be a blast. I. Uh, I'm. I would love to bring Frank from for Frank does Rhonda because that those days you know, will happen. It's coming. It's coming. It's, I it's have coming. faith. Oh. That was almost. That was almost what I did uh, last night uh, when I was just ready to. Oh my God! I'm so angry. I'm so angry. I thought, well, I'll just rant. What if I had Frank come out? And I considered just having Frank that's, start ranting. And that's was, what's great about puppets, man. It's like you could just you can get away with shit, you know, because it's the puppet. I was. I don't think this Rhonda, way. Frank did ranting. Yeah, Frank did ranting. Well, he he did Rhonda. He has regrets, and now his ass is ranting. <laughs> That's hello. I am Frank. Uh, it's a little bit different. It's a little bit different. Oh my God! I see pins are still hanging out. Oh, oh, boot is hanging. Out. You just. She's not muted. She's low. Well, she's muted every now and then. You see her coughing. You can't hear her. She she mutes because. There's a, stuff going on around her. There's stuff there going is. on around her. And so she's trying to, you know, be professional that oh, way. Oh, fuck yeah, Gemma. Gemma says I'm going to be bringing back poetry streams on my channel. Oh, oh, oh cool. that would be... Oh, that would be awesome. I, you know, I would do poetry readings, but I don't think people would appreciate it. I, 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 I don't think it would come across... It would, it would come across as sarcasm. I just know it would... Robert, peace and love, peace and love. Thank you for swinging by. Everybody, make sure you are clicking that like. Uh, and share this out. This is this is kind of safe. We don't have the puppets out. Uh, we're not, you know, we're not really defecating all over uh, your airwaves. And so right now is not, uh, is not a time to worry. You can actually share this with the friends that are cool. Not, not with grandma. Although grandmas, some grandmas are cool. I don't know. Yeah. I've... You know, every now and then. Every now and then you get a all right kind of grandma. But, oh, she's dying over there. 
Uh, the poor, uh, poor thing. Poor thing. It's terrible. It's terrible. Oh, where do you find? What are we looking at? Uh, 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 Gemma, uh, Gemma, are you over there? Gemma, are you there in Allie's chat? Uh, is Jess over in your? Is Jess in your chat? Uh, it's at uh, it's at Gemma's. Uh, she's got a wrench. She should be able to drop. Uh, Gemma, uh, drop the link to your channel so uh, everybody can get connected to you for when you bring those poetry readings back and everything along those lines. Oh, you're in mine. You're in mine. Well, let me uh, let me let me figure it out. Are you in mine? Is mine just not updated? Is that what's happening in mine? Oh my God, what's going on? I posted the link to Gemma's like channel in uh, your chat. Okay, there we go. There we go. I apologize. I had not, I didn't know where we were at. I did, uh, nothing's been updating over here uh, for first. the chat. It's terrible. It's absolutely terrible. There is the link. There is the playlist. I see, I see Gemma. This is the channel, everybody. If you're looking for the poetry readings that are coming, Gemma's Journey, Grace, and also Kick Butt Coffee. Uh, there's a uh, there's a club in Austin called Kick Butt Coffee that has punk shows, that also has poetry readings, that also has uh, several other things. Kick Butt Coffee. Uh, uh, do a search on it, and uh, and that is one that actually has some neat shows. There's never a crowd in the. It's it's a shame because Gesundheit. Oh my. Oh, are you okay? Oh, I worry. I worry that you're just gonna. Sneeze your smooth brain right out your head one of these days. It's it's sad. No, you can't, you're muted, so you can't defend yourself. I could say almost anything. No, I this. totally agree. And I also just posted the link to Cake Butt Coffee in the private chat. Do you want me to post it in the real chat? I want to make them work for it. I want to make them work for it. If you want to find it easily, it must easily be able to be found. Kick Butt Coffee, uh, uh, search for that. And uh, get connected to, and tell them, tell them one of our channels. Say they sent me. Uh, they said you guys are freaks, and see what they respond with. I, they, I don't know them. It'd just be fun to kind of intrigue them with some. We got some trolls coming through, kind of thing. I, I would, I would do that, Gemma. I would do that. I. Uh, 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 at, uh, rich new design at gmail.com. I, I, I enjoy, I enjoy or orating. Uh, I guess, would that be the, the term? I could enjoy. The, yeah. Uh, yeah. Poetry. That would be it. That would be the term. Is that, is that the yeah, term you, you, for? you enjoy oral. Yeah. You enjoy uh, that, oral things. Now, yes, I'm, I'm not going to, you know, <laughs> this, I'll, I'll, I'll go ahead and I'll agree to that. Yeah. I'm not going to deny that. I, because, you know, it's so close to he has risen. I don't want to get struck or anything along those lines. Oh, she's she's nodding. She's But we don't know. We don't know. There's things going on. Smooth brain. Smooth brain. Oh, but yes, uh, uh, contact me when you're when you're doing that, uh, Gemma, because I, uh, I'd, you know, I'd find a piece uh, and and read that or I could. I could write something or I could uh, be moved in the moment and create on the spot. That might actually, I don't know. The, sometimes those can be dark too. Sometimes those can be dark. Who doesn't? Who doesn't? You know, there are people. There are people. A little bit of, I, uh, you know, oh, I'm, I'm going back to childhood here. Uh, my father. My father, when you say who doesn't, Pinzer, and I believe we're talking about oral. Who doesn't enjoy oral? Well, my father, he's, he, I believe dad enjoys being, and I know another guy, I know another guy, and I'm not going to, if he's watching, and he, he probably isn't, but I have given him a hard time about it uh, plenty of times, because, uh, uh, no, you don't, you don't, you don't go down there, you don't, no, you don't eat that, you're going to get sick, that's how people get sick, that's how you get colds, that was the, uh, that was the, what I like to call the, how not to please a woman uh, speech that my father gave me. No, you don't go down there. You don't do that. Sister Edith Bunker. Oh, you're working. What's going on? Took the laptop. 
Stealing meds? Oh, oh, Sister Edith Bunker, I'm feeling bad. I'm feeling bad for Sister Edith Bunker. I think Sister Edith Bunker is probably over there on Will Dick, uh, the Art of Floundering podcast uh, uh, channel. No, you're hanging out over here, sister. Peace and love, peace and love. Everybody, make sure you're hitting all the channels. Click on the like on all of them. We got nothing. We got nothing. All we got are likes. If you if you help us, that helps the algorithm. Because otherwise, we just don't have shit. You know, we we don't have anything. Uh, uh, all we the only thing of quality coming out anywhere is Muti over here. She does great art. Otherwise, otherwise we got, you know. Uh, otherwise, it's a just a lot of sickness. It's a lot of sickness. Your that's art is at you least going down there too much. You're getting yourself. sick. That's how you get sick. You go down there and you and you get sick. Maybe Dad was right. Maybe Dad was right. Maybe all my troubles. All my problems are related to that. I'm not going to believe that, though. I'm not going to believe that. It's, uh, although it is almost like heroin. I mean, you know, when you think of, you think about the things that you just, oh, my God, I love doing that. Uh, like Coke, you know, it, uh, Coke. And, and so, uh, you know, I, I like jogging, but I'm not going to get really excited about jogging. I'm not going, yay, jogging or anything along those lines. So that's not the kind of same rush that you're going to get. Exactly. Exactly. Oh, I got to... It, it, that is the thing to do. Join, join the group of lunatics. That's how I get by. That's how I get by is uh, joining lunatics. Everybody, I want to mention again, the artwork, like I was just talking about uh, with everything, the... The artwork uh, that you see in our logos, that you see in uh, in different things, and if you are going over at night with these amazing art streams that Allie's got going on over at her channel, where she starts and and finishes a, a, a an amazing abstract piece, uh, and lately they've been glow in the dark. Everybody, lately oh my they've God, been glow the in the dark. Glow in the dark is I, I, see. I knew that would cause you to unmute. I knew you'd have I to love, fucking. It was, I love glow in the dark. It makes me so look happy. Look at your face. Look at your fucking face. How happy you got just just from bringing up glow in the dark. I knew that was one of those hot button things. Uh, but make sure you are connected to the channels and her. The link to her catalog is up at the top of the of the chat. So make sure and click on that thing so that uh, you know you can get connected. So you can you can see some of that the amazing more like work. Satan. That, or, uh, not Satan, Santa. Satan. <laughs> <laughs> I had a typo yes. with my words. Yeah, you're doing a typo with words. That's nice. That's nice. That's that's so professional of you. Sister Edith. Sister that's Edith right. out there. Making sure people aren't touching themselves and engaging in self-abuse. Good job. Good job, self-sister. Are we not supposed to touch our... I thought that was a part of live streaming. Isn't, isn't that half of it? You can you, uh, talk to people and... God if you're touching and yourself. Uh, you know, Look, as long as you lie about it. Have you smelled that son of a bitch? I don't want to hold hands with him. I mean, he reeks. He fucking <laughs> reeks. He's like every animal. He's got the smell of every... It's like being at the Brookfield Zoo. You're like, oh, don't they clean these cages ever? What's going on with this place? So, yeah, I, I don't need to be that close to God. He's He doesn't have good hygiene. I, I'm not I'm not all that impressed. Sandwell. Well, he he's, loves he's, the feet. He did. It's all yeah, about but <laughs> it's all about the feet. You know, that's the thing I noticed about that book. There's a lot of homoerotic uh, uh, feet washing going on. Yeah, I, I, I just, you know, how can you not see that? How is that not just talked about openly? Oh, oh, and then he did what with all their feet? Oh my God, I, 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 I know this is this is like a, a softcore porn. Is that what this is? <laughs> You'd see it on Showtime, the washing of the feet. Uh, it's bad. It's bad to do that the day after uh, a major religious holiday. But it is April Fool's Day, so I'm going to feel okay doing it. I'm going to feel okay saying whatever. So the song, I Touch Myself, is a lie? Well, it, it depends. Are you thinking about me, Bimbo? Because uh, uh, when, when I think about you, I touch myself. That's, that's the way that goes. Uh, uh, what, which song? Which song? Is it... Uh, you know, uh, what's the, oh, what's the song? What's the one uh, uh, about masturbation? I can't, 
I can't remember now. <laughs> too many drugs. <laughs> Way too many drugs. Tonight, if you are in the Colorado Springs area, everybody, tonight you are going to want to be at Vultures because there's going to be an open mic. Look, everybody, it's, it's doggy flavor, doggy flavor, Charles Charlie's Pimp. pimp. Charlie's, pimp. Yeah. <laughs> Charlie's Pimp, doggy flavor. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Welcome. Welcome, doggy flavor. Uh, uh, how's your boy Charlie doing these days? How's everything going, Charlie? Or doggy flavor. He's doing great. He just got back from a little T uh, turpentine uh, sex party. <laughs> Good for him, man. What? I didn't know that he was still doing those. They yeah. quit inviting me to those. It pisses me off. I used to get to go, but... We play nope. a naked ping pong over there at his parties. Oh, that's, uh, I guess, erotic. It doesn't sound, you know, sporting events really don't seem that, that erotic, but especially ping pong. But, you know, maybe, maybe is it... Is it we just don't want to get hit with the ping pong ball in the wrong spot. Well, that, and, and, and the edges of the table are a little rough. I don't know if you've played a lot of ping pong, but the edges of those tables, it's not like slate or anything. That's kind of, it's, it's rough on the edge. I, I don't think I'd want to run into that. Things, it's, uh, you know. That standard well, what's up? Uh, hey, pal. Ping pong, what's uh, happening, where man? You, where you use Viagra instead of paddles. Is it, you got to hit it with your penis? I, uh, I'm out. That's how Sir I'm out. used to do it, so I'm not sure. That's how everybody used to do it? What the fuck that happened to ping pong? Nowadays, but I what do you do? What do you people do in New York? I mean, my God, that's just... This is sometimes the shit I hear from... the. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. It's It's not the ping pong of my childhood or anything. That's... That is not Ellison Winterland. Peace and love. Have I missed anybody else out there? Oh my god. Oh my god. Common cunning linguist. Yes. Perfect strangers. What a great show. What a great that was show. a great show. It was. It was. Now are you playing I mean, I know it's a moving target, but are you gonna stream later tonight, like after nine thirty, Wes? You thinking? Oh man. I'm lucky I pull this thing off each weekday. Yeah, I, 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 I have no, I've got my, you know, I've got my trauma call at 11. I have right. no idea what what fun lies ahead of me for that, uh, you know, so that'll kind of dictate after that. I may do something, uh, if I do something, it'll be before, well, fuck, I'm not even going to speculate. I won't even speculate. Uh, uh, write me when you get back. When well, you no, get I back will, from but I'll, I'll keep an eye out. If you guys go live, I'll probably join you from my phone. You know. Um, oh shit! If you yeah, yeah, if you were gonna if you were gonna be live, we could uh, we could yeah, set up do something and, like and that. have the uh, you know here's your here's your live from vultures moments. Uh, that that right. would be cool. Yeah, I'm but, gonna tr I'll, I'm also gonna try to do some recording. I'm try to get some interview. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. I mean, it's really weird. I mean, I feel bad because I'm not nervous at all. I'm just, like, looking for a place where I can comfortably inject weed. I mean, there needs to be more weed injection sites in the bars here in Colorado. But um, it, 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 there'll, be, there'll be guys that are just pouring over their notes and shit, and I just don't like bothering them because it, it's just they're just really, like, into it. And they're like, what are you here for? And I'm like, uh, I'm here for the comedy, but I'll be over <laughs> smoking weed until it happens, you know. <laughs> that is that is kind of one of the uh, hallmarks of this group. Uh, the Get the well, lack of I'm planning. Not, the <laughs> lack of fucking planning. <laughs> here we go. Let's do this shit. Let's let's, let's let it. this let's do this. Let's let this ride. I love that though. I love that. It uh it's more of a challenge that way. It's more of a challenge. Because I'm afraid I don't do that well at those uh, ping pong sex parties. They sound, they sound terrible. They sound... <laughs> I don't... It's a, it's a new world, and I just... I feel like I don't fit in anymore. Oh, no. Oh, you gotta no. keep up. Well, uh, ping pong. It, it's, that, was, that was a childhood game I, I, used, to, I used to play. And, uh, really? Yeah, really? I just ruined it for you. Here. It it kind of ruined it for me. No, I at at a young age, I at the YMCA, 
Uh, there was a there was oh, a paper on whoa, this. Oh, young age at the YMCA. Okay, I know where this uh, is. No, the story doesn't go there, interestingly enough. No, uh, I had a ping pong table at home, uh, but I went and I, I, there was, they had a ping pong course. So I actually learned regulation, you know, ping pong and all that other legal serves, all the other stuff. Well, at the end, they had a big ping pong tournament. And so, and I'm the only is child. Is that what they give I'm, you the Viagra? I was a child. I was, uh, this was, and this was way before Viagra. You was wouldn't it a understand naked these things. No, it wasn't one of those naked pink. No, this was okay. early on in life. And I was like eight. I was like eight. I'm the only child in this tournament. And I oh, won yeah. this Let's tournament. Be, uh, everybody hated me. Everybody was angry because I was beating everybody in the tournament. And I was all happy, but there was a lot of negativity. There were a lot of adults going, this this isn't right. I mean, this isn't fair. This uh, why is this kid in this contest? So they're all pissed, like I'm some ringer brought in to play, and uh, and I think now that I realize that ping pong is some sort of deviant sex game, I understand why everybody was upset that there was a child around during the game. Uh, uh, I'm sure I ruined everything. I had no idea that that you uh, you freaks did all these things with ping pong and now it's ruined my childhood. Well, did you you want an invite to the next one or? Oh God, no. Oh God, no. No, I don't know. Now Frank might. Frank might. I had, uh, Frank did Rhonda. Frank of Frank. He might His want an invite. little parties are off the hook. Frank, uh, Frank needs a social life. You know, after things went bad with Rhonda, everything's kind of gone to shit. And so Frank's looking to branch out there and naked ping pong parties sound like what Frank needs in his life. That, that's kind of it. Is is that right, Mark's gas station? Are naked ping pong parties what everybody needs in their life? And and welcome, welcome in. That is uh, that is the welcome I wanted to extend as you come in the door. Whenever I can meet someone with something you know nice, I I try to. Oh my God. Yeah, exactly. I should, I'm a little bit. Please. I'm a little bit. Well, I, I, there were there were gummies, and and there was uh, there and was then a there's plate. no more gummies. Well, uh, exactly. Uh, but there's also there was a plate of of stuff in a cabinet that it was like I don't know this could be years old, like like shake and stems, but there's shake everywhere. Like oh, a new bag must have been gotten, and this plate was just stuck here with the last one of the remnants and the stuff that was on that. And some new bag must have been attacked after that. I don't know how old this is. And it it definitely, my lungs wanted to reject it, but it was working. And yeah. so, you know, it's one of those, I may end up, I may end up, you know, uh, having something wrong with me afterwards. But Das Green, ping pong and black light, probably trippy. With the penis, I would think. Do you put any paint on the penis? You know, uh, do you put paint. numbers, glow-in-the-dark paint on the side I of the mean, penis I'm sure and all that? other people did, but we didn't, you know. We just had to... You just had to swing it. it, it, is, it is, is it all based on Viagra? I mean, it, there's cock rings involved to keep things keep things going and all that. Okay, it, it just... Yeah, well, I told them... I mean, they, they will supply some Viagra, but if you don't show up quick enough, they run out. So then you, they have to... Give out the cock rings. I told oh, him a million times these parties are getting out of control. He's lucky the feds haven't raided him yet. So oh, he's man. filming it all. It's crazy. Some of the kids used to call it ping pong. Ping pong. Jesus. Ping pong. Jesus. There we go. Ping pong, everybody. This show's getting uh, getting a little low. And, and interesting. I've got a story dealing with cock rings. My uh, my brother, he is uh, he's had to move back up to Illinois because his wife has had to go take care of of uh, of her parents, her dying parents, and so they've they've had to move in with the the father who is moving around on a walker. He's got to have blood transfusions and all this going on. My brother comes back to get another load of stuff, uh, drives back down here and everything, and he's getting ready to go back and calls. Oh, my dad's gone home. He's, uh, oh, and my brother's face kind of, and he has to tell his wife, I, I think I left my cock ring on the sink in the bathroom. And she's like, 
He's he's already gone in there. He's in there right now. Uh, so it was one of those. I didn't hear if there was any. Oh, what is this? Is this a shower curtain rod ring or something? Because he's leaving his cock ring around. And is there an etiquette for leaving a cock ring around? Is it acceptable to just leave that on your bathroom counter, or do you clean that and then put it away? What is the the etiquette with things along those well, lines? Well, a lot of I, things can be misconstrued as a cock ring. So, you know, that's a whole... It, it's it safe. something else. It could be a napkin holder. It can be a lot of things. We don't know. Napkin holder. There you go. Napkin holder. It could be any number of things. I had no idea it was used in ping pong. I had no idea. You can't hear? No, it could be an earring. Earring. Okay. That was... Yeah. There we was, go. Jesus. Lots of things. This this show. Just if you oh, wear it, wear it with confidence. That's wear all. it with confidence. Well, yeah. it, you know, that's it. Black light. He was a grower, not a shower. <laughs> oh, the, the chat's even getting into the nastiness. That's when you know you've made it. When the chat gets into the nastiness, then you, then you feel as though you're entertaining some people. Has everybody clicked on that like? Has everybody uh, given that like and all that... Uh, now, now Funk Fest, Funk Fest, beginning at four. We dropped the link to it once in both the chats. Uh, beginning at four twenty Pacific time on Saturday. Am I correct? Saturday the sixth, Funk Fest at yeah. Camp Gmay. Yes, yes. Twenty five. Yes, did you know that Saturday night on Fan Appreciation Night, Bimbo Barbarella came up on panel? Did you know that? Oh, I I did. I, I did. I saw that. That was awesome. I saw that. I was really and I I had I had personal tragedy night. Uh, yes, not, we just, we have suspected that. It, it was. I would not have been a fun addition to the evening. It, it would have been a. Uh, you you well, would have seen an, you were probably like in a cage in a basement somewhere trying to get out. So oh, I wish I wish I had something like that to concentrate on. You know. Look at that ben. fucking legend. Hey, Ben. Ben, Cheers. Ben out that. there. Peace and love, Ben. Peace and love, Ben. Good to see you. Uh, uh, no, I wish I had had something, uh, something along those lines to think about. Well, I did not, I did not, I did not, if he had left it in there to be cleaned afterwards, I'm not sure. I don't know. He just said that he had left it on the counter in the bathroom. And, uh, so I don't know the condition of the cock ring, if there was still lube on it, if it was, you know, just really needed a wipe down or anything like that. When the father-in-law walked in with the walker, I, if I get an update, I will ask. I will let him know that, hey, my viewers, my viewers want to know, was that cock ring clean when it was on that counter or was it all nasty and uh and you know what all had had gotten on with that cock ring, and just uh, and just you know let my brother's whole sex life just out there for the world. Uh, <laughs> hey, look. Hey, everybody else <laughs> left, so I decided to come back to. No, nah, it's okay. I was going to make a joke about everybody left. The cock yeah, ring. Yeah, the cock ring drove everyone away. Wes. It, it drove everyone away. No, we're having yeah, a good time. Right up there everybody. with pistachio. That, that, that's kind of, pistachio yeah. always drives them away. There are moments, and that's the beauty. You can look at your analytics, and you can see when all your viewers leave, and you can you can then look at the video and say, well, what happened in that moment? And usually, it's when I arrive. Usually, oh, yeah. it's when I show up. Everything falls apart. People are like, oh, well, I don't need yeah. to be here. This is... This is just going to be one solid sick joke, and, and I don't need blame this it on in the gummies life. too. If we want, you know, I do. Uh, yeah, well, you know, everybody warns me I should just do one, but I don't. I end up doing too many, and uh, I went on a show. I went on Gorilla Gamer show on Friday night at nine o'clock, and I had done all the gummies as I as I often do. You clear the room and, over there. Uh, yeah, I think. Well, it, uh, I went. Early on, I went straight to some bestiality jokes, and uh, wow, and it just that work out? kept going. It, it, surprisingly, it was okay. I I was worried because I was on someone else's channel, but he had already queued up and put together uh, the Bo Derek uh, Tarzan movie, 
I don't know if you remember the 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 Tarzan movie with Bo Derek, but it was a whole wet nipples thing, uh, and and so he's showing that, and there's a gorilla over there next to him watching the two of them in the water, and so there were all these bestiality jokes uh, about he had uh, so he had them lined up. I, and afterwards, I said, I don't feel so fucking bad now. I said, I I know I came in here, and right away I start in. And on somebody who was in the audience, Andy Gambino. I started in on Andy making jokes about Andy banging, uh, not being allowed within a thousand feet of a zoo. And uh, that was kind of where things where things started. And 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 it went okay. Pinzer was there. Pinzer can say whether or not it was uh, it was good. It uh, it. No, I didn't lose the crowd. Okay, see, I I actually heard, I heard good things. I did, uh, there were a lot of fisting jokes. I was, you know, I did have a lot of visuals going on. Wind socking. Uh, uh, wind socking. And for those, you know, if, you fi- if you're if you fisting an anus and you accidentally are pulling that colon oh, out with whoa, your hand, whoa. they call that, there we go. See, <laughs> see, it, it's just, oh, I've driven one away. No, uh, that was uh, wind socking. That's what that's called. Push and block. so I had, I had made reference to that and, along with catfish noodling and uh, just, I don't do that for the same reason. Get this off my hands, you know, that kind of thing. I I went hard in the paint. I was, I was as low as I could be. Uh, wow. Represent. When the, uh, exactly. I felt like, you know, people expect this from me. I really don't want to hold back just because. And uh, somebody else, got, Thriller James, Jimbo, he shows up. And I uh, and I just went down a you're a serial killer uh, path with him, and it turned out to be pretty funny. I uh, I had a good time. I had a great nice. time doing it. It was a uh, it was kind of a blast. Uh, I don't know if I'll be invited back. I mean, I, he did say I would be invited back, but I I can't say for sure I'm going to be invited back. What was that you about? Burning bridges. Outage? Well, that's what they're there for. Bridges get burned. That's that's how that you you know. Well, the eye is in the beholder, just like the cockering is uh, uh, on the beholder. You know. Yeah. You know. For sure. Yeah, it. Uh, I. I. Nobody expects me to be uh, anything less than that. And so, if you've got me coming to the show, you kind of have to know anything uh, could be said. Uh, now right, I, it's coming. Yeah. Know what to if expect. I'm told to be clean, like Betty J. Gathers, I've I've gone on her show and uh, been interviewed and everything, and not a single, yeah, there's there's innuendo, but I I keep everything clean on her show and all that, and it was uh, a that was one of the most yes yeah exactly that was one of the most fun interviews I had. Too much wet, yeah, yeah. the The phrase is that wind socking. It's it's it it had to be. And the the groan, just the I mean, that was so rewarding, the fucking groan I got out of doggy flavor down here for the uh oh 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 the visual once you realized what Winsaki was. Will, how are you doing, buddy? You look like you just robbed a bank. <laughs> just moved right on. Oh, uh, just dealing with the cold, man. That's <laughs> it. We're just getting more bullshit how's it going out that maybe like you held up a liquor store or something oh yeah. that's later that's later that's once All the right. sun sets man it's my hobby you, you know what i i hope you're not still disgruntled at all from getting stripped of you know your lifelong dream of uh winning a camp g may cd i know that Ah, oh, dude, I'm a little. I, I am pissed. I mean, that was like that was that was a lot of fun Saturday. A lot Gary, of controversy, West. Yeah, I mean, what was her name? Miss Luck. Luck. Yeah, Miss boy, Luck. She was, she was really Miss honest. Luck. She's I, from Sweden. I, she I watched all the other. controversy. I watched the dispelling count. I watched yeah. all the. How <laughs> long is it going to take them to figure out who won Cindy Lauper True Colors? What yeah, the yeah. fuck is going on? That was, I was, <laughs> and, and that was that was kind of the attitude I had at the moment. Because remember, I'm raging about other situations. I'm watching, trying to laugh. What the fuck is going on here? It was one of those. I had uh, one of the best uh, streams ever that night because once again, I really want to uh, 
think all the um, people that come and watch the streams, that was real important to me. That was a fan appreciation night. It was cool. Once again, I think everyone that came and showed up and acknowledged all these really, really cool Chatville people, man. And hopefully they'll all come up on panel at some point, you know? That's the goal. Yeah. Yeah, that was a. Cool. Uh, it was a good night. It was a good night. You had a lot of everybody seemed to have fun in the chat. Uh, it was a good time. I'm looking forward to next week uh, when Kurt joins you up there, because you know Kurt's got that. Kurt's going to be bringing it with the uh, the thinking beard. He's going to yeah. be there bringing the thinking beard. And now I'm planning that's, on. That's all he needs to do. That's all he needs to do. Just that's it. he's right there. And chain that's smoke. He's gonna hold it down. He's gonna hold it down with chain smoking and beard stroking. That's yeah. uh, that's Funk Fest, everybody. Funk Fest. Karen's gonna sing at Funk Fest. Karen is singing at Funk Fest. Karen wow. will be half, at least half of my set is gonna be sung by Karen. Uh, so she should you know, be pregnant. She should be showing dramatically. No, I, I, yeah, I don't. You know, I don't. I don't think that's a. Uh, uh, you know that that baby didn't make it to term. That's what I'm saying. I think uh, you you see in the phantom. No, no. What little uh, Velcro I, is not going to get born. Oh man, I I don't want to lose my headphones. I got a coat hanger over here. If I if that would help the illustration. Oh my god. I just no. The baby's oh not the, oh there's god. no baby here. There's no oh baby here. I, I would, How could you well, do that to well, Velcro? No, that was well, especially it's Falcro. How could you not? Why would you bring well, that to We don't know if it's Falcros. We could be Ramones. No, we don't. We, it we could be that. we eighty four eighty six. Be that that's little mini I, rolling pin shooting sawdust. What, he's uh, uh, leaving those splinters in Trixie's throat. That's what that's what's going on there. For those of you that don't know, there's really sick puppetry and animation and other stuff. That's what FDR is. That's what this, this is four-fifths of the cast. We are missing Gampro. Gampro, peace and love to the oh, Gampro. Gampro. Oh, Gampro, and I know his, it was just dropped not long ago. Look at that. If you aren't connected to Gampro, make sure that you are connected to Gampro. I'm leaving my hands up. You take care of it. That's right. No, it's yours. It's yours. I'm backing up. I popped into his idea zone this morning. We got some really cool stuff done. You're gonna love it, Wes. I I was I was not even into my first cup of coffee. I saw that and it was like, oh, I got I got this show. I'm doing it for. Yeah, I yeah. It was. I got to bed like seven. It was seven a.m. when I laid down. It was seven fucking a.m. when I laid down. It's getting worse. It's just getting worse. I can't. Oh, I don't. I don't know. I just don't know anymore. But I'll make it. Everything's everything's gonna be fine. All right, uh, now, uh, uh, Allie, Allie, have you seen? Has everybody seen the numbers she is pulling in these nighttime streams that she's getting? Yes, it's incredible. Uh, she's getting some great numbers coming in through these. Uh, uh, she has doing star these power. That's why. Look at the star power. I told her the same fucking thing. I told her the same fucking thing. I said, yeah, yeah, just the personality and everything, it's going to work for her and all that. If it was just us three up here and she wasn't here, no one would even... It'd be nobody would give a shit. I could be making much worse jokes because there would be nobody watching. Nobody. Yeah, we're riding her her. coattails. It's obvious, you know? It makes it even more obvious if you go out and look at her art. Uh, pinned to the top of the chat uh, in 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 the different uh, chats out there, lgleg.threadless.com. She's got her designs out there, uh, and the FDR shirts are out there for the logos. Are they Get still out 13? There. I I don't think so. No, wow, that, that I was going to buy five of them at that price. Sign up. Sign up for the if you go out and you sign up for the email list because she has uh she lets Threadless set the pricing on the uh the items that way when threadless runs a site-wide sale her stuff gets included in the sale it automatically adjusts so if you sign up for the email list you get notified of when they have sales and and that sort of thing uh so it may it makes it worthwhile and it's worthwhile just to go out and take a look i see mike good night bimbo yolo bimbo's leaving you taking off and she gave us a wonderful compliment, too. We're lunatics. 
there, there's free shipping over orders of $99 right there. So that's the, that's the deal. Felines. Oh man. I've, I've been Foxy having a feed on this. T-shirt. You. Hey guys, I got to take off. I will see you a little bit later, man. Okay, uh, uh, right. Peace let and me love. know when you're going to be, if you do go live, let me know. <laughs> I may go ahead and set up. I may set up. All if right. you say, if you say I'll be live in 30, I'll go ahead and I'll get something going. Man. Okay, man. So All right, talk to you guys soon. Enjoy yourself. He's doing a. He's going to an open mic at Vultures. If you are in Colorado Springs, uh, any of you out there, what are the chances, right? But if you are, head to Vultures tonight for the open mic, and you might see Will Dick from the Art of Floundering podcast. He's got slider. He cut. He got a new thing. He's actually going to uh, use a physical lube jar tonight with super duper what? peachy king kid and everything else. No, he's he's he does he does serious drugs, man. He's doing a lot of the pot. Wow. He's going out in public and doing this stuff in front of people. He's bringing it in front of people. That is, uh, he's got those cojones, those those uh, comedy chops and cojones that you need. You know, you just, you just need. Uh, Foxy received her little T shirt, and she's gonna do a reveal short. She's gonna showcase the little T. T-shirt on a short. Oh yeah, that is uh, that is that is awesome. If you can Every... wait one week, there will be a fifteen percent off sale. Is in there one, one coming in a week? In yeah. one week. In one week, everybody. Don't think I won't be hyping the fuck out of that when that comes. Uh, you are gonna hear uh, that that this thing is coming. Get that going. Get all. What that is the sale going. a week from now? What is it? It's just a flash sale that they're doing. I love it. A flash. A flash sale. Like. Jeez. Oh, I, no, I, I won't. I won't. I'll be good. He's He's got another shirt on under. I, All right. I mean, it's just, I, it, I, I mean, I, if they, it would help the ratings, but I just don't, I don't, I don't see it helping the ratings. Well, I just flashed I you my man's ear. Hey, the man's ear. Everybody, man's ears. Can you get artwork on a man's ear, Allie? Do they have man's ears? Do you have any man's ears? You know, Are there we might. We might. Let me let me double check. I have seen everything else. I have seen prints. I have seen it on mugs, glasses, on on uh, on bath mats, on bath towels, on beach towels, on hats, on everything under the sun, refrigerator magnets. Son of a bitch! Everything. It's on everything. You can get it with frames. Wall tapestries, I bet. If you have a, if you need a new comforter for your bed, I bet you can get it on a comforter for your bed. It's all sure. available at lgleg.threadless.com. And the link is pinned at the top of the chat, everybody. Go there now. But next week, there's a 15% off sale. I'm sorry. I, I'm doing my best. You know, they, I, I, I'm trying to do the promotion. I'm trying to do the different things, but I... <laughs> I, you know, I'm failing. And well, it's I, I blame it on the the fucking ping pong stuff from earlier. Sure. And I, I was I was so young that was, and now that I've realized it was it was all some sort of, uh, you know, weird weird erotic thing that people did ping pong. I sure. I never put that together. I never put that together. I never realized. I had, I didn't know I was right there in the middle of of freakdom and and just didn't know it and ruining everybody else's good time. Uh, but it all makes sense now. It all makes sense now. The paddle, the ball, it all makes sense. I should have known. Wow. I, really I never thought of it that way. I, I really should have known. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm terrible. I could. I haven't, but I could. Oh, uh, there you go. Chad, uh, it's your son. It's your son, Allie. Hey, hey here's you. my son. Allie-san. Allie-san. Okay, Welcome. gang. I got to get going. All righty. Hey. Thanks, Daddy Flavor, for coming in. Saturday, Saturday, Camp g uh, uh Funk Fest. Get your asses there. Get your asses there. Peace and love, Doggy Be Flavor. Rock Peace City. and love, Doggy Flavor. <sighs> well, what are, what are we doing? Are we, are we... Jesus, that was just so fucking rude. <laughs> That was so fucking rude. I, I, I you know, I, that was, 
That was uncalled for and rude. What do you have going on this evening? What are you going to be doing over on L Alley? Is it Alley Patches on the YouTube? It and everywhere Alley else, Alley it's Alley Alley LG. You might want to, so you have a unified. That's what people uh, on the Instagram on everything else. Uh, it's up to you. You're still drawing the crowds. You're still drawing the crowds with your painting streams. Uh, doing the 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 calm awesome vibe of the paint streams everybody has a good time with the vibe at the paint streams the music's yeah, so kind of going one of those later. another another four or five hour one gonna get in the get in the zone and just be intense with it and and uh oh that's awesome that's awesome everybody if you are not connected uh, the link's getting dropped somewhere. Make sure that you're connected. Make sure you're connected to everybody on the on the thing. Uh, uh, do we need to do any more of this? Do we need to do any more of this? Is there is there a purpose or reason? We've gone an hour and something. We've done something. We did it. We. I don't see a need. I don't see a need. I think uh, I think this has been good. We've got the coffee with FDR. Uh, every Monday through Friday, uh, at least until the show comes back. Uh, we are going to be doing coffee with FDR at 4 p.m. Eastern Time. Uh, whichever members of the cast are awake and can make it will be here. That's kind of how that goes. I barely made it. You saw how much uh, uh, Will Dick from the Art of Floundering podcast was... He was yawning like fucking mad. It was like he just got up before all this. He has... None of us, none of us are any good. We're all outside the box, outside the box. That's 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 how I'll put it. Uh, is there is there anything other than that link at the top uh, and next week the sale that you would like to promote, Allie? Um, I just want to promote good health and uh, drinking water and, you know. <laughs> Keep doing it. Keep going. Smoke weed. Drink water. Have a good day. Stay safe. Don't get murdered. Stay sexy. All the things. All the things. And to, uh, all positives. I like that. I like that about you, Allie. I like that about this whole crowd. This is a stay positive. Good stuff. Good stuff, yeah, everybody. We're good at stuff. Yeah. This evening, if Will Dick from the Art of Floundering podcast contacts me and says, I'm going live and I'm going to have my camera. I want to do it live on YouTube as well. I'm going to set something up. So we okay. might end up... Josh's Cannabis Reviews. You just made it in, Josh. Oh, we're getting ready to bail, Josh. We're getting ready to bail, but I, I, I appreciate you swinging in. I'm probably going to run one of those tonight. I may pull the bass out. I may bring Frank. Cause I kind of want Frank to do some stuff and I, I'm in a mood. I'm in a mood. So everybody, if you want to see what in a mood means, check it out later. Probably going to go live. Uh, uh, with lack of anything else, we will, uh, we will go ahead and we will say, uh, is it, is it good to say goodbye to everybody? We're going to say goodbye. We love you all. Peace and love everybody. <laughs>